Hey, you guys can clap. Clap, clap, clap. I'm paying attention to the back. Guys, we're super excited today. We have Paul Shear and Rob Hubel uh, from everything from Human Giant to Children's Hospital to Crash Test to uh, these guys do Tons a million things all the time. The league. And He's on the, the league. The league. That's right. The league. My Come God. On. Transparent. He's in Transparent. Um, and but today, today we're here. We're here and we're going to be playing Gauntlet. I'm excited about Gauntlet because Gauntlet was the game that kind of sucked ass, but it was also <laughs> awesome as a kid. Like, you just kind of run around really awkwardly. Now, mm. this front screen, it already looks a million times better. It's going to be a million times better. And to make things a little worse, we're playing this game right here, Bean Boozled. And the deal is, if you've seen uh, us do this before, uh, every time one of us dies, we have to spin the little uh, wheel of jelly bean wheel of death and it's either going to be a delicious jelly bean or one that tastes like garbage. So, yeah, you know, you, we can't have guests here without treating them poorly. So, there you go. Has anyone gotten sick from the jelly beans? Actually, we did this with a cast of teachers that show teachers, uh -huh. and one of the girls had like immediately jumped up and spit out the rotten milk one. Wow. So, rotten let's milk, make yeah. a rule that you can't spit it out. Oh, yeah, no <laughs> spitting. All right, that's a rule I have no, in my personal no, life. No, no, it's a rule that I have in my that. Twitch Don't life. Talk about that. No spitting. That's how I live. That's it's a life rule. Uh, I hate being boozled. Somebody already said. I love it. Hey, Shady Fridge, what's going on? All right. I didn't diss Retro Gauntlet. I loved it, but it was yeah. not the highest. Of uh, of graphic ability. No, I'm not gonna take my shirt off, Internet. There's yeah. no way I'm not gonna do that. Uh, and uh, I will say, like my sister and I, when we always played, because you couldn't keep moving, so yes. she would just sit in the corner just to annoy yeah, you me. Shoot arrows. And then you yeah. can't. You yeah. Can't. All right. So. Uh, most important thing, you gotta choose your character here. Also, we've unlocked the Necromancer. I don't know if you guys are into Necromancy. Yo, of course. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I love it. Of I mean, course. I do I that all big, night. I think I gotta go old school. The the elf is my classic elf character that I used to play. Elf is tight. I'm Shoot going. That. I'm going Valkyrie. I like a strong woman. Oh I'm yeah, going, that's you know, because nice. I kind of feel like a strong woman. She looks like she has some skin disorders. She yeah. there's eczema or something there. For, oh, hit X, hit X. There you go. I'm going warrior. Warrior, alrighty, let's do it. Sure, All right, hit X. We'll get into it. I need a bigger cod piece. <laughs> <laughs> How do you bend over to tie your shoes with that skull in the way? I think it would, the top of the skull, I feel like, would dig into your it's fine. stomach. It's a nice it's cod totally piece. Fine. I feel like, yeah, exactly. That would be a. All right. I, oh, all right, so it's a little bit like. Look at you. Oh, yeah. Guys. So let's see. I think square. Oh, here we go. Are we supposed to work together? Yeah, I think, I, I think all we're right. all pals. Okay. Ooh, Morak. Oh, Morak's a little, uh, a little arrogant, Morak. I feel like I'm facing the wrong way. <laughs> You're so passive aggressive. You're not even giving him the respect he de Morak deserves. Morak is looking at my butt crack. Guys, we have to find the three lost shards of turf thing. I am already lost in this game. <laughs> it, it is like uh, like one of those terrible movies like Gods of Egypt. I'm already <laughs> like, what's happening? Just let me shoot arrows, please. Yes. <laughs> oh. No one has ever Guys, seriously, we should make the face oh cam smaller. God. People really want to get some of the amazing graphics here <laughs> and see what's happening. Yeah, Maybe we should just make the face cam the whole video, yeah. and we should just describe in Illustrator Pros <laughs> what's Wait, where's happening. Wait, my guy? Oh, there he is. There He's running. All right. I feel like running into a giant flaming mouth is always a good start to a game. Again, that's something I, we go. in my personal life, take very hard. Tombs of the Risen, anyone? Ooh, all right, let's do it. I would love to. All right. We keep saying we're ready, and it keeps yeah. starting. Do it. Find the lost shirts, said somebody. There you go. All Keep right. it classy, Twitch. All right. That's right. I'm, I'm trying to figure out what... Who's someone different... saying you guys are the best comedians ever in the whole world to California? So there oh, you go. all right. Well, take it. Well, there you go. I love hey, that. What's this gold? I got some gold. Gold, I think, is... is uh... So this is like kind of like old school yeah. gauntlet. It's not It's not as updated as I thought. No. I get some, like, <laughs> some classic, you know, like some new gaming. No, not at all. You know, if it ain't broke, don't fix it. And if it is broke, just don't also fix it. Just let it be broke. That's what I say. Right. Cause mostly because I'm lazy. Wait, that's you, by is the way. Is this Shrek doing the voice? <laughs> <laughs> they got Shrek. <laughs> Where's Donkey? I gotta get Donkey. Uh, <laughs> yeah, Donkey's an unlockable character. Oh, I just had some turkey dinner. Ooh, well done. Ooh, look at those guys down there. All right, I gotta Hey, that's out. a nice dance move. You like that move? That's pretty sweet. There's more where that came from. Yeah, how did right. you... What is this? Oh. I found a secret room over here. Ooh, I think I found a key. Cube was holding us back. Sorry. Sorry. Slow us down. Got a key. 
Oh, wait, Rob, you're in. Wait, you're in Keanu. Yep. How did it go? What did you do in Keanu? I haven't seen. Uh, it I'm, I'm the annoying person. neighbor. I'm uh, I'm uh, Keegan's annoying neighbor that uh, hooks up with his wife. Oh, that's awesome. And uh, I'm not in. I'm like the. I'm about the only white guy in the movie. They needed one white guy, and so they called me up. <laughs> You're the token white guy. Yeah. Well, I'm having well, trouble figuring out how to shoot. I think it's uh, square. Square. I'm hitting square, and nothing. My guys. What like... about if you hit? Oh wait. What oh. did you just do? I hit it twice. Hit it twice. Oh, oh. There you go. Wait. Oh, that. Just that. Oh, it's. Oh, I see. Oh, wow. Okay, now I got it. Oh, there All you right. go. Perfect. I think we need to find some kind I of. I have a key. Oh, you have a key. All right, let's go this way then. We're... Walk into that big door. All right, here we go. My question is like, what are these guys doing when they're not attacking us? They're just hanging they're just around, hanging talking out. to each other. Look, you know, life in a dungeon. Oh, I got killed. Right. Oh, right. dude. I just I learned how to. You got to. I think you have to do I'm the back. bean boozled thing. All right, I'll do bean boozled. Should we try it? it? Yeah. All right, bean All right, boozled. All right, spin the thing. Cheers to it, bean boozled. All right, here we go. That's right. Uh, what did we do there? I'm not quite. This bean boozled. Uh, all right, I do go. like my spinner. What is right it? A green one? What I is got it? lime or lawn clippings. All right. Lawn clippings. Get it? I think it's one of those right. right there. All right, lawn clippings doesn't seem too hard. Yeah. I'm from LA. This is like. Um, this could be a. You th pay for this. this could be a Food Network show. You know what I'm saying? Like you play video games and eat. It was like lawn clippings. Really? Yeah. Wow. Not That's bad. Not that bad. Though. Not dirty. Yeah. yeah. It's like a, what did you think it was gonna taste like? Maybe lime. Does it, it taste lime like, does or it taste lawn like clippings? Grass or does it taste like leaves? That's I'm a good question. Grass. Or bark. It's more grass, no dirt. It's a very nice flavor. Lawn clippings is kind of a blanket term for all those things. I agree. Yeah. Um, I, that's the thing. That's Jelly Belly has now started uh, using their powers for evil. You know. <laughs> like, I feel like they got too excited about the Harry <laughs> Potter thing. And now yeah. they're like. Wait, so the Harry, what was the Harry Potter thing? Because they had jelly beans and Harry Potter? Yeah, that all tastes like poop and stuff like oh, that. Oh, great. Know? So, uh, yeah, Thanks, so, J.K. Rowling. Yeah, you just Your legacy. Your Somebody legacy. Somebody asked if we ever played anything. Oh, yeah, yeah are you guys gamers? Um, no. I would like to play games. Uh, no, I, I don't I don't play as with much. People, with, with people, with people's hearts. Yeah, yeah. always. Well, yeah, um, with the, <laughs> I'm an always. Xbox guy, and whenever I, when, and whenever I play PlayStation, I feel totally, uh, my, I just get confused by it. What do you mean? Like I just the controller's different to me, and I don't know if I feel as comfortable by it. Oh, interesting. You're so you're on edge right now. I am. This is oh. Oh wait, how does that? You gotta hit. X I will say they need to do a thing where all the things are the same. Yeah. Because X on one is like Y on. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh, oh, oh yeah, there we go. That was me. Sorry. I don't like this archer power. Read by nature. That's right. Gauntlet, man. All right. Here we go. I got this. Oh, hey Anthony, go. what's up? Rob's the only one using his special, that's true. Wait, how do you use your special? Oh, there we go. Um, oh, circle, I think. I don't even know how I'm doing Now that. I'm figuring he's, this. Not, he's just a natural. Oh, there we go. I'm just a natural. I just like to dance. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to get out there on the floor. Oh. Yeah, yeah I want that turkey. turkey. Wait, Rob, you're not a gamer. What was the last video game you played? I mean, I played Call of Duty on Xbox for there a while. There we go. Uh, did you just die again? I did die again. Oh, man, you Guys. gotta do the thing again? Just all right. Just spin, all right, there you go. My guy has Sorry. to go number two. Where can he go number two? I Arrow was a wrong choice. It's a dungeon, I think, anywhere. Basically, to, it's in. To, it's in a giant. Trying to get the good. Here, I'll hold spin. it. You spin it. All right. Oh, oh that right. was even worse. All right, go. God, this is the worst spinner ever. Oh, there, right, we, there go. we go. Blue, blue, toothpaste. Toothpaste. Come on, that's nothing. I'm really avoiding. That's easy. Uh, all right. That's eat. So far, delicious. Toothpaste. Toothpaste, yeah. Oh man, all right. Now I don't have to brush today. So, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, he's I got back. hit by lightning. No, he's back. I'm back. Oh, Not calling him. That's me. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, my shirt today says Virginity Rocks because we're playing uh, Gauntlet, and so this is kind of Dungeons and Dragons. E. That's what yeah. I did, by the way, all in high school. I spent every Friday and Saturday night at Denny's. Uh, playing. Um, did you ever play the Marvel Dungeons and Dragons? Or I never you, did. That's a good one. No, I never. Hey, did. I can't kill all these guys by myself. <laughs> I, <laughs> Sorry. I'm, I'm clean in house. Oh, over. I died. Oh yeah. Now you oh, have to play. There we go. Here we go. Disgusting it's on now. Bernie's boss. It's on now. I. So I'll be back in one second. I just ate your body and got tons of your gold. Do you have oh. any idea how fun right. it is to kill someone you with get? an axe? Butter popcorn or rotten egg? Here we go. Oh, that's gonna be gross. Oh, that's definitely rotten egg. They've taken all the fun what out of it. Wow. Oh wow, that is. Oh ma'am, sorry. I don't, I'm just. I'm uh, convulsing over here. That was really bad. I'm extremely oh, not happy. I got killed because. Ah. Uh, oh god. We might have to put up. Yeah, we may have to. Like, we might have to not do this. So at much. the end of the uh, the gross. boards. Or I just something. exploded some dynamite right in my own face. <laughs> and you're still alive. It's the warrior, man.
Okay, I got okay, how do we get back? Key. How do we get back? I got in? some kind of key. We got a revive. Oh man, that was that was really disgusting. Uh oh, I gotta get away. I had rotten egg, Lulafon, and it was very rottenny. Where are you guys? There's no spit. We're, we're both I not able to revive. I think we're both dead. All right, so do I have to keep going by myself? I think so. Because I'm gonna go kill these guys. That's life. All right. We believe in you, though. I, I think if you kill more guys, we'll be able to come back. How do I carry this? Oh, X. No, oh, don't. Oh, God. No, get away. Get away. Uh, here I go. Are you impressed with our Twitch uh, gauntlet skills? Yeah, how are we doing, yeah. everybody? You're good, Paul. All oh, right. wait. That's what Beth oh, said. Oh, no. Screw nothing. you, Beth. <laughs> uh, I tried to get Jesus. People. When you light the barrel, you have to run. Uh, you can even vomit rotten egg. I don't know what that means, Timo. There's yeah. a little delay, so. All right. Oh my God. Where no, wait. Are. Tell uh, as we're just sitting here. Tell yeah. people about Crash Test. Uh, Crash Test is a special that Rob and I did. We took our stand-up show that we normally do and put it on a moving bus. And we <laughs> drove around LA literally on a moving bus, and, and we bumped into crazy people on the street, like awesome. legitimately crazy people on the street. Awesome. At like one o'clock in the morning in front of Man's Chinese Theater. Oh, that we is. We met babies. Heart of crazy. Who sang? We met two Johnny Depp's, which you know was funnier at the time. Now it's a little bit more scandalous. Were they were they both uh, the same era, Johnny Depp, or was one no, like Captain Jack? One's like Johnny Depp, and one was Captain. Jack. Got it. Got and it. And then we I accepted the Johnny Depp. I love it. Do you ever get anything for free? And he was like, Yeah, I get a lot of stuff for free. I could. I got a free taco at Baja Fresh one time. <laughs> That was it. So if you dress up like Johnny Depp, you can get a That's free, just one, a free taco <laughs> at an establishment not as popular as Taco Bell. If you dress up as Johnny Depp or just get a coupon. Oh, we're back. Yeah, we're back. Oh, you're All back. Right. Get in there. Awesome. Yeah, keep killing people, now I can come back. I think we have to earn our, our extra lives. I think lives. I got killed. Oh, no, you're back, though, I think. You can come back, maybe? Oh, it's up to you, Paul. All right. Uh, that's awesome. Yeah, and like Aziz is in there. Yeah, Aziz, you, yeah, you Aubrey Plaza, Rob with. Cordry. N Natasha uh, Leggero. Yes, uh, Earl Sweatshirt, if you like Odd Future. Woo! The guys from Reno 911. Awesome. Yeah, playing the the character from Reno 911. That was great. Uh, uh, Jack McBrayer. All the guys, all the hits. Yeah, you can see it guys, on Guys, I'm iTunes. really, this is really uh, tough. <laughs> I need to know how to, somebody on the boards tell me how to use my superpower. I need this superpower badly right now. And what is it? Just Are you just witty? Like, what is your... Um, the archer is witty. Yeah, yeah I think that's, yeah, that's just, He just said like he does a quip. <laughs> yeah, he's just like, take these quips. Um, that's awesome. Wait, wait. That's and, sorry, and I can't plug. You guys it. originally. I, tried to defeat it. I know it's really hard to talk in. You guys originally started uh, in Respecto Montalban, right? Yeah, is that we, how you guys met? Um, how did you guys actually at, meet? At the uprights, we met at, Yeah, we met at UCB in New York, yes. and we were both way back in the day, kind of the first wave of guys to like. Start taking classes. Yeah. And then Back when Amy Poehler was teaching classes. Yeah, Crazy. it was like we took all took classes with like Amy Poehler, Matt Walsh, and stuff. But it was all guys like me and Shear and like Cordry and Rob Riggle yeah. and Ed Helms and all those guys. How cool is it now that like you guys have really taken over Hollywood? I mean, you guys are doing, you guys are in everything. It's well, look, awesome. we're here now, and yeah, this is and it. here. <laughs> I mean, we've taken over gaming. <laughs> yeah. Oh, thank it's God, currently. that was a tough one. I, come on, you. Oh. But that's got to be kind of neat. It actually know? is like, really cool to. I mean, we were all. We. I always feel like we were just in the right place at the right time. You know, like because now UCB sure. is so big, really I'd probably be scared to to get involved now. But like at, at the time, you know, they were just the theater was just getting going. So yeah. we had we had to put up shows like every night of the week. And uh, I swear we were performing in New York like yeah. five nights a week. That's crazy. So, yeah, we just had we got a lot of stage time and. Um, yeah, I remember. And the, the we first the, uh, the first UCB theater for people who don't know yeah. was an old uh, strip club. Strip club. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. And people would come in and they would be sitting down there and they <laughs> and they would expect the strip show to sh start and they would watch like an improv show and they would get so upset. Oh, they'd be so upset. <laughs> you would realize in the first couple of years we were performing that people were like just leave mid show. It wasn't because the show wasn't good. It was because we were not taking off our clothes. That's how McBrayer got involved. Actually, he was coming. He was a frequent uh, right. contributor. He came with the strip. Yeah. Guys, what is happening, dude? Like, I, I have no. We, we no want support. to get back in. Hit Axe. See if you can hit Axe and come back in. Oh, you're back. Where am I? There you are. The red. There you go. Doing your dance. What a feeling. <laughs> Take that. Take that. Take that. Gold on the right. One of the weirdest shows we ever did was a show called Robot TV. It was television, television for robots by robots. And, we, and it was basically just an exercise to piss off the audience. Um, we would just walk around in, yellow, in white jumpsuits and just sing, uh, sing where a guy played an electric guitar. It was the craziest show. But it was a midnight Friday show. So, you know, we were like those cool people who were hanging out at midnight at Friday. I know. 
I mean, you, uh, like, Rob, you, you, you say, you know, it's like the right place at the right time, but there is, you guys, I mean, absolutely work so hard. Like, yeah, everybody. for sure. I mean, you know, we didn't make any money for, you know, the first 10 years. Of, you know, I, you know, it, yeah. you, everyone was poor for so long. Yeah. Um, but yeah, to your Thank point. Thank God for Subway. Yeah, but to, but to your point, Baja Fresh. R.I.P. Yeah. R.I.P. Jared. Oh, R.I.P. Um, Jared. R. I. P. But, <laughs> but to your point, it is really fun to look around now and see how many people from way back then yeah. are, are still like kicking ass and comedy. Absolutely, yeah. I remember seeing like you and Riggle and Kung Fu Grip like back yeah, in the yeah, day. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That weird transitional theater theater though yeah, wasn't. Yeah, that's right. It was like for for ten minutes. It was like so okay. Was, I can do Human it, Giant was so damn good. That's right. Thanks, Thanks buddy. That's Ooh. awesome. All is right. there is there anything like are there any character? I mean, you guys. I mean, have created probably hundreds of thousands of characters over the years. Are there any like characters that you guys love that you haven't been able to bring to TV or movies or anything that you get? You I go had back an to? idea for a sketch that I've never been able to do, and I loved it so much. And the idea was, um, you know how you have like a genie, like a genie in a lamp or something yeah. like that. Uh, yeah. But I wanted one to, that you get. You were so psyched that you got it, but it's broken, <laughs> so it kind of works, but it just doesn't work. So it would, it would give you weird rhymes, but you could never actually. Actually, you just didn't know what it meant, so you just kind of put it in the closet with like a Nordic track. Um, and I've never been able to do that. That's so hilarious. Much. Although yeah. I did do a meth genie. There we go, meth genie. That's yeah. pretty good. I feel Sweet. like we still have notebooks filled with ideas for sketches that we never got to, and like eventually we'll have to go and do another sketch show. Did you guys ever, do, when you would get down the show, would you go and then write your favorite highlights from the show? Because sometimes, like, you, you're crazy. Sometimes, so yeah, and then. Not uh, really. But you know what I mean? From, from improvising? Yeah, from improvising. Yeah. Sometimes it, it didn't always translate. Valkyrie! Like, Woo! Greediest hero. Aww. That's what I, that's how I'm known. It's awesome. <laughs> Killing it. Ooh, I don't know what any of this stuff is. You guys got a lot of things. Dying I only got one mystery. <laughs> um, no. Here we go, catacombs. That's where mm. shit gets real. I'm gonna change up this archer bullshit. Yeah, hit a uh, hit uh, circle. Circle, okay. And then yeah, I think you can All change right. your guy. A wizard blows, by the way. Oh, does it? Just, okay. It's worse than the archer. All right, I'm Just gonna try so you know. necromancer because oh, why not? Go. All right, so, uh, whoa, look at Necromancer. Oh, yeah. Look at her body. Woo! Here's a good idea. A, a serial killer with short-term memory loss. I don't know if that would be <laughs> a great sketch as much as it would be violent. It would just be like, just... <laughs> they, Nutchie, and you watch your hands where I'm rubbing that crack pipe. Perfect. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, yeah, I know. I'm not sure if that would be yeah. right. Yeah, exactly. What is that? I, oh, did, I do Hit think X. I said I would suck someone's dick if for a wish or something <laughs> like that with the meth at genie. <laughs> that makes sense. Well, yeah. I vaguely That's probably what that. it is. Mem <laughs> yeah, I had to be painted all blue, which was the worst part of anything. Uh, if you guys are just joining us, we've got Paul Shear and Rob Hubel here uh, from um, everything from Transparent to The League to Crash Test, which you can ah, see on ComedyCentral.com or CC.com. Also, uh, Filthy Preppy Teens. Which is on the full screen it's app. The full screen app. Which, if you don't know what that is, don't be alarmed. It's brand new. Well, the Necromancer just kind of just runs into people. Woo! Necromancer, I think, creates other things to fight. Okay. Oh, oh, you have to stay away from death in this one. Oh, okay. this sucks. I got killed by death. Oh, this blows right now. Sorry, the, Necrom the Necromancer is like the Flash. Whoa, look at that. Doing a lot of running away. Oh. Oh! Uh, Necromancer got tagged. Wait, can you, uh... I can't regenerate just yet. Uh, Wait, there, you're back! I, no, Stay not. away from death! I can't kill death? Oh, no, no. Oh, God. The fact that you can't kill death is ridiculous. I agree. You can keep, yeah, it's like... These guys, I can't believe... These guys must just be so boring in here. Nobody even has any phones or anything to, like, look at. Well, that's why they're ready to attack you. They're ready to come out. Yeah, they're a, just pissed. That would be a great video game. It's just people looking at their phones. <laughs> That's a kid's, what's called, uh, life, I think. Life. I'm looking on the, the, the chat here. I, how goes Gauntlet? God, I'm ejaculating, Tom, the bomb. I saw ejaculating right. happening, and that's, a lot of the times when people watch oh. me play stuff, they will primarily ejaculate do, the entire do time. People, <laughs> that's a natural, yeah. when you see Paul. Do people meet, oh, I mean, yeah. do people from your chat room like meet up ever in real life? And, oh, no, oh, I hope not. I hope that would be, that's that a little. Cool. Can you come back, X? Not yet. Um, I just, I think I just killed death. Woo! You, can't you did? Death. Really? I think, I mean, oh, he well disappeared. Done. Only, well done. only Benjamin Button. Death will never that. die, just as love will never die. That's true, you know what? That's very true. Here he comes. Hey Rob, somebody said that I Love Your Man is your best character you've ever played. Oh really? That we was a long died. time ago. 
Death keeps. I feel like, like that's a that's a total comedian response. Like, <laughs> yeah. yep. Like when you say to Conan, yeah. like, yeah. Oh, here we go. When you say to Conan, like, oh, great show. He's like, what? So yesterday's show. Yeah. yeah. yeah you're just like, what the hell? Um, it's the absolute worst. You haven't had a jelly bean yet, but you've died. I think got, it's time for. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Read okay. by nature says the barbarian skull belt is the head of a former opponent. Does... He wears a skull on his belt for post mortem humiliation. Oh Jesus! Oh shit! Wait a second. Death keeps getting his period all over the carpet. <laughs> Right, how do I spin this? I, we, the spinner we, sucks in this. All okay, right, what is it go. there? What do you got? I got, uh... What does that look like to you? Lime or lawn clippings. Oh, li all right. He had that. All right, I'll do it again. All lime right. or lawn clippings. Or do you, you want to spin again? I'll spin it again. Let me spin it again. But I feel like Paul's had the two easiest one. What is that? Toothpaste and lime. Well, you, you peach you? or barf? <laughs> oh, get that peach, man. <laughs> Give me that barf, bro. All right. We get it? So let's see which one it is. It could be peach, though. Yeah, it could be peach or barf. Peach or barf, okay, man. I think this is it, right? Your whole your no, whole showbiz one, right? career has come down to this yeah, moment. Oh, peach or barf. oh, yeah, you're right, you're right. Peach or peach barf. Or barf. <laughs> I hope it's barf because I love barf. Oh, this is peach. <laughs> oh, <laughs> nice, perfect. That's peach. You you and if it was barf, I was gonna be like, wow, you took that very well. What are, are you, you guys feeling I don't about barf. Gauntlet? Are we liking Gauntlet? Are we like we can we can always switch to if we hate this. Barf. This guy says barf tastes amazing. What? Maybe that guy's barf. I think it kind of depends about what you what you uh, what you eat, what you're barfing up. Someone Yo, said I just how wanted was your Father's Day, Paul. My Dream Father's Day was great. My wife treated me to a great Father's Day. Oh my God, awesome. Uh, oh God. We lost our kid, and now I'm not technically a father. It was a, you know, it's weird. <laughs> I'm really bummed out about it, but you know, you know, didn't want to miss the, uh, I didn't want to miss playing Gauntlet on, you know, on, you know, just getting out and. Playing. Well, you're gonna go find your kid, right? I'm trying to figure it out, like, and we're, you know what? It How is? did it happen? How is, was it just? Oh, uh, it was a it's roller a park coaster, situ oh, roller a roller coaster, coaster accident, obviously. Uh, of course. Because you know they always say like, you know. Um, they're like, you know, use the seatbelts. And I'm like, yeah, I don't want to listen to those rules. Yeah, I don't play. I, I, I make my own rules. In yeah. Life, you know, I don't live by anybody. Oh, rules. crap. Here we go. Why wow, this death I, is coming on a, on every level here? I think so. Ah, dead again. Like stop signs, suggestion. You know, like yeah. I don't need to. I, there's a lot of rules in life I don't live by. Rob, Swa you, I don't swallow. Sometimes I'll just chew my food and spit it right out. Yeah, well, you have to. Uh, it doesn't Rob, matter. Can you say Curtisaurus and then growl like you're annoyed? What? Hey, what? Just say Curtisaurus. Which one are you reading? I went by quick. Oh. Curtisaurus and growl like what? Like you're mad. Curtisaurus. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> That's very uh, gentle. Somebody wants me to sing the Doritos uh, theme song. That was from Human Giant. No, yeah, no. Nice. I don't even remember it 100%. It was, uh, Doritos and the yeah. lightning crash, and then the old man says, Hey, everybody, <laughs> I'm eating a big old bag of Doritos. <laughs> I remember that we didn't have the rights from Doritos to actually do that. Like, if you do a sketch like that, you have to, like, ask permission. We shot this, really? We yes. shot this sketch where we're making up dumb jingles for different candies and snacks in the grocery store. Yeah. And, yeah, we shot, like, a million of them because we didn't know who we were going to get permission from. Oh, wow. I think my necromancer just built a coffin and put people in it. <laughs> That's like some WWE yeah. shit. Yeah. I love that. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I've been dead for about 10 minutes. Yeah. Maybe I yeah. should eat another jelly bean. Yeah. <laughs> this is, there's no way. All right. Yeah, you had, you made extra, oh, uh, death. Is gotta get that bar. Get that bar. Juan yeah. wants to know, when are we coming to Puerto Rico? Rob, when are you going? Where right are you going? Now. Do the right name now. It. I got me, I keep it, I keep I've it been, solid. I've been People to Puerto think. Rico. I got, I shot a movie with Jean-Claude Van Damme in Puerto Rico. What? Yeah, I got kicked in the face by Jean-Claude Van Damme. Oh my god, he that's wasn't amazing. He wasn't, Bucket list. He wasn't supposed to kick me in the face. He was supposed to go like by my face, but his shoelaces hit me in the face at like Jean-Claude Van Damme speed. Almost. Holy shit! Yeah. That's crazy. Okay, wait, I got one called Booger, or Pear. Yeah, I feel like Jean-Claude Van Damme's not that tall, right? Um, are, you, are you taller than Jean-Claude Van Damme? Yeah, yeah, a lot of people are taller than Jean-Claude Van Damme. <laughs> Don't people. say that, because then he'll do a split <laughs> and make his ass envelop your head to suck you up his butt, because his legs go out like this. <laughs> That's his fatality. That's, yeah, That's his fatality is yeah. okay, What did you get? Oh, yeah. it, well, it wasn't good. I think I got, like, grass. Or, Ooh. Yeah, it's like, gr I was trying to get booger. But Somebody wants grass. to Maybe know. Maybe we, we should just try eating them and trying to identify what they are. That's a oh, better like game. That. That's a better game. That's Someone wants to know what, uh, how did this get made we have coming up. Uh, oh, yeah, that, and that's a podcast where uh, you guys watch terrible movies. Yes, and, yeah, and uh, the podcast I have coming up uh, this week is uh, Simply Irresistible with Sarah Michelle Gellar and a magical crab. 
who that's uh, a real movie. <laughs> a real movie, and the, and the crab makes food. <laughs> it's kind of like a stupid version of uh, Ratatouille. Oh, okay. Uh, I, <laughs> Ratatouille way before Ratatouille came out. <laughs> Wait, it's pre-Ratatouille. Pre-Ratatouille, it's Ratatouille. It's the prequel, basically. Wait, can you get back in here, Rom? Oh, yeah. There we go. Um, How Did This Get Made is great. What's the worst... I mean, I'm sure you must get this. What's the worst movie you've seen? It's tricky because, it, like, sometimes the worst movie is not what you even want to talk about. Like, Because the they're most, not even... It's not even right. funny. Like, to me, I think one of the craziest movies that we've seen... Oh, wow. Uh, is... Oh man, there's a great, there was a great movie called, uh, oh, okay, Arnold Schwarzenegger is Hercules in New York. It was his first movie Hercules that he ever did. He ever did. He can barely speak English. Oh my god. Uh, and he is running around as Hercules, and he gets like involved in the wrestling world. What? The and fuck? Uh, he makes a friend who sells pretzels by the dock. Okay. And uh, it's ridiculous. <laughs> it's the best. <laughs> It, does it all work out for him? Um, yeah, well, of course. I mean, he goes back. Well, come this way. Come through the door. Uh, uh oh. He, uh -oh. he uh -oh. goes uh -oh. back uh -oh. to. Oh, my God. Uh, stay away from death. He oh, goes, I got my period. Yeah. Yeah. I'm getting my period. Maybe he goes it just back smells Mount... terrible. It's just his B.O. Oh. It's like pig pen. He goes what? He goes back to Mount Olympus knowing that, you know what? Life on Earth isn't better. It's better to be a god than a man. <laughs> Great Which lesson. Which I could have told you right out, of the, <laughs> yeah. right out the gate. If you have the chance to be a god or a mortal man, choose god. I feel like if you were a god, what would the, what's the first thing you would do? I mean, I feel like shoot lightning bolts. I don't know why I, where that came from, but why not, right? Yeah, why? I mean, it'd just be like, it'd be fun to have some kind of a superpower. If you're a god, can you time travel? Is that a god feature? I mean, Ooh, I know that, like, in know. the Bible, there's no time traveling. Mm. Uh, it's not like Superman. At the end of Superman, they fly back and the world goes back. Do right, all, exactly. Do we yeah. all get killed? I think we all got killed. I all think right. we, let's just try a new level. Yeah, you guys all this, try a jelly bean. This guy sucks. All right. Just try one and we'll try to... Uh, you guys want to go into the uh, grave of the torturer or the mm. palace of Kahamun? Oh. What do, you think it is? what do you think it is? Hold on. No, that'd be, that'd I feel like it's grasshopper or something. I got toothpaste. Toothpaste. Ugh. Toothpaste is not bad. Ugh. It's actually a nice palate cleanser. There should be more candy f that are toothpaste flavored. Oh, this is um some kind of fruity thing. This is good. Dead fish. <laughs> really? Ugh. The dead fish. Ugh. Oh my god. What do you got? I did a movie as long as I get Nick Cage in the Why podcast. Why just call Never. It? No, because he, I don't think that he'd be, unless, I don't think he'd be psyched. One time I went to, uh, one time I went to an uh, estate sale oh. of Nicolas Cage's. What? Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I heard about that. It was crazy. Here? Yeah, here, and it was nuts. And I bought all these little, I have like so much weird Nick Cage shit in my house. I have a weird meditation mm -hmm. uh, thing where you're supposed to stare at for like 15 minutes without blinking and then it you like revo it revolves or was something. Was he just selling oh, off wow, his stuff it. to yeah, make money? Yeah, I we, bought some we went, to, we went to Michael Jackson's estate sale. Whoa! Like yeah. right, before he, right before he died? Or, yeah, or, you can or, actually see the pictures if you type oh in. Uh, no, not before he died. It was when he was being sued. Oh, yeah. before it was, he did it was before he died. Oh yeah, it was yeah. before he died. Yes. But, but it was it, he. He put everything for sale because he needed money, and then he took it all back, and he was not going to sell it. But so we went for like one weekend and Whoa. looked at all Michael Jackson stuff, and it was all like really creepy, like yeah. kid related. I have a Flickr Whoa. page. You can look at my Flickr page. Oh it's my just Paul Shear and Michael Jackson auction. Oh my god, that's insane. Um, I'm ready. Have you guys hit? Oh this? yeah, sorry, I'm ready. Uh, that's crazy. Yeah, it was rough. I got all the best thing I got. Oh wait, guys, we just broke that Michael Jackson died to the forum. <laughs> oh, no. oh, I am so oh, sorry. No. Spoiler alert. Here we go. This I feel like is a good metaphor for like my life, just hacking and slashing yeah, through yeah. Na through haters. I gotta you say, know? I had uh, much higher expectations for this game. Yeah, and I feel like it's not as. It's kind of an. I would rather be playing the old gauntlet. And I, agree. I wish that was a feature that you could have on this. Mm, that's true. Like you could just hit a button and it would go to the old stuff. Yeah. Well, I wish the perspective wasn't. Get an out aerial, of there. Wasn't an aerial view. Yeah. Like, exactly. Yeah. I would rather be on the floor. It shows off my bald spot, I think, which I don't enjoy. You know? Yeah. I can only see like my deltoids. <laughs> yeah. You're oh deltoid. yeah. Oh, look at this. Whoa! Guy. Look at this wizard. An enemy Ooh. discovered. Uh oh! Whoa. Whoa. Wow! Yikes. Don't uh, don't get in the middle of that. He's got like the Ghostbusters. That's, that there. was terrible. What just happened to me? He's got like Ghostbusters stuff. 
Uh, what do you guys think of the new Ghostbusters coming out? I am I'm excited. excited. I Katie it. wrote it, right? Katie Dippold. Yes. Dippold. Katie Dippold. She's a UCB, UCB person. UCB or former Conan intern, I would say. Oh, was, oh, she? was she? That's right. Back in the awesome. day. Uh oh, Dynamite. In New York days? Uh, yeah, New York days. Like 2000, let's say, two? Nice. Oh, man, this guy. Do we kill this guy? Is Aaron, this guy like death? Oh. I got murdered. Oh, no, we can't kill this guy. Oh, or he can kill you also. Yeah, I think he's doing more of an effective job at that. Exactly. Yeah, you guys were on the show a bunch. Yeah, that was how I made my money. That's totally doing... how I paid my rent in the early days that was, was awesome. doing Conan bits. What, uh, do you guys remember any bits you were in? Oh, oh that's I remember These that I became the go-to Ronald McDonald, <laughs> which sucked because he'd have to get painted as Ronald McDonald all the time. And oh, I just had a barf jelly bean. <laughs> Ugh. Yeah, exactly. Oh, it's definitely bubble. Uh, oh. And uh, yeah, so I get painted. They also. Oh, bubble. I, I, uh, then there's a guy who became a, who was a professional clown. This guy Brad Aldis. So then he got the Ron McDonald stuff. Oh, he stole the gig from you. Yeah. Or so, it took it happily. Exactly. And uh, so then I, because he could do his own makeup, you know. Mm, um, so yeah. that's our show. That's how cheap we are. So you can do your own makeup. You, you're out. You makeup um, guy. I'm trying to think of the other. I uh, I I remember being a dan a jazzy walrus. But the, by far, <laughs> the grossest thing I ever had to do on Conan was a desk drive, uh, where Conan would drive around New York City yeah. on his desk, and um, and we had to I had to lay in the meatpacking district. Now, if you go to New oh. York, the meatpacking district is like a cool, hip area where like fashionable people hang out. But back then, it was just a dirty, disgusting oh, place where like literally there's still blood on the ground from the oh, pigs God. that they killed. And and then I remember laying. I was a Hari Krishna. Which was like somebody who was like in a toga, essentially, <laughs> laying naked on the street and smelling the blood of pigs. Oh my god! Worst Conan bit oh I've ever god. had to do. Oh, did it even make air? Did oh, they it just made air. It? it did make oh, air. Oh, good. Oh, that's Thank good. Thank God. I told my parents to watch. They were very uh, upset. Yeah, the worst is when you have to do something terrible and it yeah. doesn't even make air, and you're oh, just yeah. like, I suck. I remember being part of a. Uh, uh, I did. I was a part of a news network called the Breathing In News Network. It was news anchors that only talked when they were when they were breathing in. So they'd be like, hey, "Good morning, everybody." <laughs> I can't even do it. But like, so I had to do that like all day long, like do the sports report, like, "Hey, good morning, everybody. The sports was going on." Oh my god! <laughs> it's so hard to do. Amazing. You did, you did build lung strength though. I built yeah. up a lot of lung yeah. strength, which is why you can hold your breath now for what five or six minutes. Five or six minutes. That is amazing. Free dive. What, are, what about all these ghosts? Can career. we kill these ghosts? I don't know. I'm not sure what the ghosts do. It's just like the entourage for uh, for other. Uh, oh, I thought you meant this game is like entourage. Yeah, this game is. Yeah. It goes on forever it and it has no point. <laughs> and no one likes it. <laughs> and, yeah, and everybody hates it. Tank Pool Network, I'm going to give you a shout out. <laughs> Life is made. <laughs> Can I get a shout out? The Hank Pool Network. There you go. Yeah. Exactly. Trump should be a ghostbuster. <laughs> I was just looking at that. Trump should be a ghostbuster. Where is illegal immigrant ghosts? How do we get out of this room? I don't know. This is it's this is hell on earth. We should just switch to a different level. Uh, oh, my first appearance on Conan was what was that? My he cut my hair. Uh, this is I just started. Actually, That's a did, terrible. Wait, did he cut your hair in the audience? Uh, oh no. Okay, because I once I turned down a bit where like he's gonna shave your head in the audience. Oh I'm no. Not gonna oh, do no. that. But no, he um he they just opened this hair studio. Oh, I got a, another puke jelly bean. <laughs> <laughs> it's so debilitating. I'm going in. I'm going in. Alfie said it was no. Alfie. Oh. Was oh, I got something terrible. Oh. Oh, what is this? Oh. You said oh. the wizard is bad, right? Wizard sucks, but you can try him. This is, a, this is a great way, if your son wants dead candy... Yeah, to give him that? If you want to wean your kids off candy, you just give them these, so they're like, Oh, I hate candy. Wait, so he cut your really, hair. Really, you can really scar your children. Oh, fuck this guy, really? Oh, I don't like this Come guy. Come on! Uh, wow, <laughs> there we go. I, I just killed... Uh, I just killed myself. You literally, like, ran at death, and you were just like, Later, dudes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm out. Um, Not playing. <laughs> Somebody wants me to say something in, uh, that I like to say from NTSF. Uh, oh man, I have to think of a shitty pun. NTSF. What is it? N NTSF SDSUV. N yeah, NTSF SDSUV, which is a show that I did uh, a few years ago, where it was like 24 but funny. I played Trent Hauser. I was like a, kind of like a more douchebag David Caruso. Um, <laughs> and you can watch them all now on Hulu. Oh, yeah. Um, 
And it's kind of nice, I will say, like, did, like the digital world has made things... Again, for you guys who've made so much, have such a great body of work, now you can see it all. Except for Human Giant, which Except you can't see Giant. anywhere. Whoa, can't wait, see. why is that? That's crazy. I don't know, and they've been taking down, we had a YouTube page that we put up, and they've been taking it down. Oh, that's madness. Yeah. It's been the weirdest thing. We like getting these, we've been fighting for years to, to try to get it somewhere. If someone wants me, if you want me to say the thing from NTSF, just give me a scenario and I'll give you a pun. I can't, <laughs> uh, can't just give me, how did someone die? You have to give me a, a suggestion. You gotta have a suggestion, yeah. like improv. Yeah, I, I need to be able to come up with a crappy pun for you. Here we go, here we go. Do you guys, as being uh, Master of Improv fellas, do you guys and ever... And we do have belts in that, like, so we have to wear this, our Master Improv. Yeah, exactly. Which is weird that, uh, yeah. yeah. It's very, it's, and you won't go on without your belt. Yeah. <laughs> it's like a weird, uh... Actually, are you guys superstitious at all, or no? You guys, it doesn't, do you have any, like, pre... Pre-performing rituals? No. You guys just have to, like, kiss I used each to other get, before you go on, or yeah, something? Yeah, I always I, I always like a good, like, mouth smooch. I used to get crazy yeah. nervous. Like, I used to get diarrhea before we performed, like... Really? I was, I just get so nervous to perform. Wow. But diarrhea makes you funnier on stage. You know. yeah. The desperation. Yeah, The Rock gets diarrhea before he performs, too. Every time you watch The Rock in a movie, he is holding back diarrhea, and he makes him funnier. Or makes, wrestling. Yeah. Yeah. He's, I mean, look, he's one of the biggest movie stars in the world yeah. right now. Exactly. So, yeah. They, they, LeBron James also has diarrhea. Gives himself, he eats a lot of soft fruit. It's weird. He doesn't naturally, he has great bowels. He has very chosen yeah. one bowels. Oh, yeah, he will. I mean, before last night's game, he just loaded up on Taco <laughs> Bell. <laughs> he's like, if I need to get off the court, so I got to start scoring. I got to get this. I got I to gotta do this. Yeah, that's how he got that block. Yeah. It was just like <laughs> flatulence. It was like. Ooh. That's what you couldn't hear. Oh. Oh, my God. I exploded. Should right we switch to it? Mario Kart? Yeah, is this yeah, killing yeah, us? Yeah. yeah. Is this killing us? Let's switch. We're going to switch, guys. We can't Someone, keep. This is just. It's demoralizing. Someone yeah. just posted right. the Will Arnett sex tape. Yeah. That was an old bit. We shot this bit where Will Arnett, <clears throat> what was it? He, so uh, you want to eat these like they're fun, but they're disgusting. That's how they get you. Oh. That's how they get you. I'm going in for whatever this is. Grass grass clippings is a welcome relief from oh. puke. What is that one? Oh, the worst one might be spilled milk. Or spilled Ooh, milk. I don't want that. Oh, oh, that's really bad. But puke is oh, like... Oh, God. It's what, really... what does puke look like? I guess I <laughs> it looks know. like puke. All right, I'm going to do it's, it's, uh, It actually kind of... It looks... I'm taking long clippings. Oh, long God. clippings is delicious oh, compared Jesus to puke. Oh, Jesus, God. I'm having a bug. I'm also drinking straight vodka. Are we, are we allowed to plug yeah, oh, yeah. vodka? Oh, yeah. Favorite sure, video please. game consoles. My parents always got me the wrong ones. <laughs> so I had like um, a 3DO, which was, if you know anything about anything, that was a mistake. <laughs> um, I also had the Sega CD. <laughs> oh, my um, God. Uh, I had the Atari Lynx instead of the Game Boy. <laughs> um, I had a Coleco instead of an Atari. You watch movies on beta? I know. The, the only time I ever got like right was when my parents got me a Genesis. But still, the Genesis was versus, like, no one had a Genesis. I was yeah. playing, like, Altered Beast. <laughs> right. And no one else was playing Altered Beast. <laughs> Altered Beast. <laughs> Altered Beast and Joe Montana football. <laughs> now I am all Xbox, uh, Xbox One. Although I'd like to get a, um, I'd yeah, like to get a PlayStation to play Uncharted. Oh, yeah. Uncharted's really fun. We had the guys... Oh, go uh, versus race there. No. There we go. All right, everybody hit A. They were awesome consoles, but no one had them. I had Pigs in Space on ColecoVision. Okay, I can... I'm oh, going to be... Uh, no I'm Luigi. Yeah, you, yeah, or if you, you can pick whoever you want. Okay. You're down oh, there. Uh, Rob, you, Rob, if you don't want to, if you want to be me. one of the characters, you can uh, hit B, I think, and it'll go back. Okay. Well, I want to be Wario. There you go. Yeah, now you can choose oh, your yeah. guy. I'm blue. I'm going to be this dragon thing. Uh, Atari Lynx was great because they had California games. Oh, wait, so hit A. Hit A. Sorry. That's all right. Here, let's switch. Oh, you here, let's switch. You, you want to drive on this crazy thing? Yeah, Is yeah. that right? <laughs> there you go. That way I'll be, uh... All-time favorite game series. I'm going Peach, man. Wow, people say Xbox One is not a good game system. Is that... Oh. that oh, wow, look at that. That's some oh. sad Vega. Oh, there we go. Uh, I don't know what any of this stuff is, so I just, uh, All right, I mean, you know, you could choose your little car or whatever. I'm gonna make it like that. See, I chose the, uh, you know, the hot girl, so then you, I'm gonna distract you guys. I like it. I don't well, even you know, know, I don't even know you which have one a, I picked. So you definitely are picking strong female characters. I like yeah, that. Yeah, always, always. Uh, no, oh, no teams. Should we go? Let's try 100cc, then we'll, we'll, we'll work up yeah, to 100. I love it. Work up to 100. Water park? 
Oh, no, we, or we, no. You know, it's hot today. It's hot outside. Yeah, exactly. It's, it's so 108 hot, degrees. It's 108. It's crazy. What are we doing with our lives? By the way, I don't know if you guys are on Snapchat, but a yeah, uh, little I'm on fact. Snapchat. If you uh, do a snap and you put the temperature and it's over 100 and you send it to a friend, you get a trophy. You get a over 100 oh, degrees. Trophy. Oh, really? So I'm going to send that out today. Woo! Now my breath smells like spoiled milk. Uh, um, but not from the jelly bellies, from what I was eating earlier. Also, somebody stole my. I did love my ColecoVision. Because they had Coleco Smurf, Vision. Coleco oh Vision, the Smurfs game, and you just basically just jump over fences <laughs> and get to Gargamel's house. There you go. All right. All right so I think. Uh, all right. So the uh, right trigger is like slide. Okay. A, I believe, is go. Uh huh. I think that's all you need. Oh yeah. Uh, oh, and uh, how do you? Uh, and uh, yeah. left trigger, I think, is how you use your little items. I believe. I am a big Wario. F oh, okay. Left trigger. Ah, Wario. I think war. Yep. Oh. Why am, I going, why am I going? In so the slow? water. In the water. Woo! What's the turbo on here? Uh, gr uh, when you get the mushroom. Okay. And if I want to throw something, I'm. Uh, I think that's left trigger. Okay. And if you hold, like, if you have a shell and you hold the left trigger, it'll kind of drag it behind you. Oh man. Um, Am I underwater? I think so. I think yeah, I'm underwater. I it feels this, great. <laughs> this is so refreshing. It really is. I don't have air conditioning in my apartment, so. What? Are yeah, you serious? No, 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 no. That's a, that's a terrible thing. It's you awful. work on TV. I'm naked all the time. You better stay constantly here. Constantly naked. Wait, better... how did that work out? Like, what? Did oh, you I know got that some kind of? I have an air. It just doesn't work that well. Okay, got it. And my landlord is, you know, uh, you know, the worst. But here's the thing. I got Does a great he... location. Okay. It's one of those things where, like, I hate my apartment, but I like where my apartment is. Where do you God. live? I live over in Los Feliz. Oh, that's where too. we live. Yeah, like, right by, kind of over, um, like, Mess Hall. Like, yeah, that's, that's right that's by me, too. There you go, that's yeah. Right by us. And, uh, and, yeah, so it's like I got a great view of downtown. The only problem is um, I have to then live You in live that above the boulevard or below the boulevard? Uh, I live on the poor side. Below okay. The, yeah, below the boulevard. I live below the okay. I mean the cool side. Is yeah. Nice to Keeping it real. Yeah, problems. yeah, you don't want to live above that boulevard. Yeah, yeah, no, it's... Get That's... caught in that Greek theater traffic. Oh, God, the worst. Guys, we're talking very specific LA right now. <laughs> I went to, uh, I know, I went to uh, uh, a party at somebody, like Woo! a friend of a friend's house who lives on the rich side of the boulevard, yeah. and yeah. they had a, uh, above their fireplace, a real buffalo head. Oh, my God. And I was like, what? It was like Dr. Feelgood's house. You Are guys remember allowed? that Dr. Yeah. Feelgood video? Are Molly we allowed Crow? to kill buffaloes? I don't know. I mean, I'm, I hope they got it at like a vintage sale. I went to someone's it house a, there was some, had a There was real... some dumbass in Yosemite that just killed a buffalo because oh they put it, like a baby buffalo in the back of their car. What? Yeah, they saw this buffalo in the oh, winter. Guys. In the winter time, they saw a baby buffalo and they thought he was too cold, so they put him in their car. Oh boy! And then the rest of the family, like, wouldn't the the buffalo's family wouldn't talk to him anymore because he'd been in a car. So they had to like <laughs> they had Just to like jealous. put the buffalo down or something like that. Oh my god! I got tons of inspiring stories. Yeah, like this. wow! <laughs> uh, some very sad news, everybody. I just heard uh, from the chat. That Wario has checked himself into a oh, rehab facility. Oh, no. Yeah, this oh, is, no. um, you know, so we're playing him here, but let's just wish him uh, good thoughts. Yeah, exactly. Good luck, Wario. Use the I think Wario, Wario must have a lot of, like, like insecurity issues, because Mario oh, you yeah, know, is, I like, mean, the yeah. star. Uh oh, what happened? You know, and you're like, Wario, you know, like, that's... Um, oh, I came in last. Oh, no. no. Where did I come last. in? Second last. Remember that buffalo? Dead. It says Fury Leaf. I think yeah, I'm Baby well. Peach. Although I don't. No, I, I think if I think like the Beth, you better try belly jelly bean. Yeah, Beth, get in here. We're, Beth, we're playing the game where you just now choose a random one. You have to guess what flavor. Magic it is. Pizza says I'm on the cool side. Oh, magic. Where, where are Magic Pizza? Oh. Let's go to your house right now. You could, you could have just said pizza because all pizza is magic. So I think your name is a little redundant. I did go to a house that had a giant piece of taxidermy. Are you up. going to the Del Close Marathon? Uh, I am not going Ooh. to Del Close Marathon. I wish I were, but I'm not. Yeah, my uh, my wife to, is super pregnant, and I am. I have uh, to make super love, pregnant. Super pregnant. Does make, that mean very pregnant, or does that mean like awesomely pregnant? She's like a superhero who's pregnant. She shoots babies out of bad guys. <laughs> shoots like, them out boom. of her vagina and boom. knocks out bad guys. That's it's amazing. A, yeah, it's a pretty intense. Uh, <laughs> pretty. It's, it's 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 definitely not Marvel friendly. It's definitely more on the Deadpool side. Plus, it takes it takes nine months to load her up. Oh yeah, yeah. She can only shoot one she criminal got one every nine shot. Months. Yeah, she really got one shot. Oh, I missed uh, another nine. Nine months. <laughs> exactly. What about some Moo Moo Meadows? Am I picking? Oh, I like Moo Moo. Uh, no, I'm picking. I'm picking. Okay. So I'm just Moo making Moo sure that I'm hitting all the right buttons. So A okay. is speeding up. 
And this is uh, loading Th up. This is this is the uh, this is your your items. Okay, got to my shoot items. Your items. Got this is like to like drift. Got it. Like uh, oh, so Tokyo three, drift. Yeah, there we go. Right, my yeah, man, right, my yeah, man. Yeah. There and we then, go. And then A is just a... A is go. I think B is like brakes, but who uses brakes? Okay, no, right? no, you never yeah. got to use brakes. I just said A the whole time. Yeah, that's you know that's that's that's. Uh... Guys, we are back with Piranha Paul Plane. Shear and Rob Hubel. Rainbow Road. That crash test. Pretty. Love the Rainbow Road. <laughs> All right. It's also uh, gender equality road. Uh, do the Kool Aid. Family Feud's dreadfully boring. Come on, you no can way. after you just watch that. Favorite Family Feud moment was the September pregnancy answer. What's that? I don't. <laughs> oh, I love, that's like, a good everyone, one too. Everyone just telling their favorite thing. Sixty-four people joined during that clip, so you're confused. But we were just trying to prove that Family Feud is actually better than you think it is. Steve Harvey should be a Mario Kart character. Oh, hey guys, uh, Modest Fiasco asks, besides each other, who's the best improviser you guys have worked with? Oh man, that's how about instead question. of best, your favorite? Mm, and then yeah. why? And then why? You know, um, improv is all about giving. It's all about yes and. It's setting your partner up. I right? love, I love improvising. Uh, well, Riggle plays with us a lot. Jack McBrayer yeah. plays with us a lot. Um, I, I used to love back in New York. Um, Conan had a writer, Brian Stack. Oh, Brian oh, yeah. Stack, That's who amazing. is like the best, and his wife Miriam is like the best. She's Miriam so Sullivan, funny. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, she's great. And if you guys actually remember, I don't know, this old late night bit, I actually we still do it where somebody where like the director will accidentally cut to someone in the audience <laughs> yeah, who is yeah. like quote unquote like screwing with Conan. That actually started because uh, our director at the time, Liz Planca, cut to Miriam who is playing a character in the audience at late night and Miriam started like making faces uh, during uh, rehearsal oh, really? and that became like an actual bit that we still do to this day because of, uh, That's so because funny. of Miriam, man. I know, yeah, Brian Mirror. Stack now works on Colbert. Oh, great. Yes. Which is fantastic. Um, yeah, Brian McCann, but you, but Kevin you, Dorf, But you guys, guys, you guys promised it to wreck his career because he, he's not working for Conan anymore, <laughs> that's right? That's what it is, yeah. That's a, that's a, real, it was a real bummer. You guys are real <laughs> jerks about that because he it worked here for years. Well, I would also decades. say... Blood in, blood out. It's like yeah. a gang, you know? I would um, also say John Glazer. I was going to say John Glazer. Yeah, John Glazer. Yeah, John Glazer super funny. Maybe. I'll say that uh, the few times that I've played with Adam McKay is really fun. Oh, oh that's yeah, fun. Yeah, yeah he's like you a really... You mean Oscar award-winning Adam McKay? Yeah, yeah, because I only like to kiss up the people who have Oscars. <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer Lawrence is a great uh, improviser. Yeah. I really love uh, <laughs> yeah, Jamie yeah. Foxx. Uh, <laughs> Daniel Day-Lewis. Oh, Smith. my gosh. Meryl Streep uh, improvising with Meryl is amazing. DDL, man. Oh, man. Although he just always does Lincoln, which is kind of annoying. It, but you know what? It's so good. It's such a Lincoln at the grocery store. Yeah, Lincoln yeah. getting ice cream. Yeah, Lincoln getting <laughs> Classic Lincoln getting ice cream. Whoa, what am I doing? All right. I have a giant Man. plant growing out of my car. I drove oh. off the cliff and someone fished me back in. Actually, in college, one of my friends didn't clean his car forever and had a little sprout in the back seat. Really? Oh, that's right. A lot of dirt in there. When I was in college, like we that. had mushrooms growing in our shower. Perfect. On purpose or? No, no, no. Uh, just by accident. Magic mushrooms? No, oh, just okay. normal mushrooms. Oh, okay. Normal well, yeah. mushrooms. I we flew. My little frog caught me too. Guys, I was I was first last time. Now back at the bottom. Woo! I will say the thing, like, uh, L.A., like, having lived in New York and L.A., New York, uh, I love New York as a city, but you you can convince yourself to live in horrible oh, conditions. terrible. Yeah. Just terrible. ridiculous. There was this place I lived in we called the Snake Pit, and it was long and narrow like a snake, and me and three other dudes never cleaned it up, so it was a pit. Yeah. And it was like, there were t only two windows. Now, there's four dudes in this right. apartment. Two windows, one on either side, and it just... It was like a tube of, it was like a Ugh. man tube. Ugh. The worst. You know, it was the worst. Uh, and you, and that's why I don't believe in pheromones because uh, no girls ever wanted to, to make out with us in that apartment, and it was just full of. Oh man yeah, because this guy, yeah. I had for a long time. Wrong just, yeah, it was just like for a long time, I kept face. getting apartments that had um, like sleeping lofts, you know. So like oh, I would sure. sleep, I would sleep sure. in the loft, and the, the, the <laughs> ceiling was like right here, uh, and like no, you know, you could never get anyone to come back to your apartment with you because they'd be like, no, I'm not going. No one's going in your loft. Yeah, yeah. How does that even? I'm gonna get murdered. I'm not going into your loft. I'm yeah. Would you like to sleep in my in this coffin with me? It's yeah. just like, I want to be this guy because I feel like he's intimidating because you can't see my facial I want to be this monkey. Yeah. Expressions. I want to play Ooh, but wait a second. Guy. I'm also going to be pink shy guy. Ooh, I like that. Pink shy guy. Overload of man pheromones. It's true. It was like always wet in there too, weirdly. Like I was humid. Moist. Always very Moisture. moist. The thing too is like if you've never lived in New York, do you guys ever have the apartments with just the hot pole? 
Oh yeah, the hot, pole, oh, yeah, the hot yeah. pole, man. Yeah. It was just basically a hot water tube that had to go through your apartment. Yeah. It's yeah. like a lightsaber, and you would just like warm up around it. Yeah. But I remember my this girl I dated at the time. Her hot pole was right next to the toilet, so you would just every yeah. time it would yeah. just be like uh, this terrible. Like tss, I always had like a burn on my arm from the hot pole. Oh, it's the worst. Um, but now in LA, you know, you don't have to have a hot pole because we live inside the hot pole. It's 108 outside. 108. TikTok clock? Yeah, let's do it. TikTok clock. Love it. All this talk about hot poles is making me horny. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, we only have a few more minutes with uh, Paul Shear and Rob Hubel. So if you have any questions about Crash Test, about a million things they've worked on, Transparent, Keanu, Children's Hospital, The League. Why we hated Gauntlet. Why you hated Gauntlet. I mean, I hated Gauntlet because we kept dying. Or if you have questions about other, if you have questions about celebrities that we hate, if you want to know who the worst (laughs) celebrities are, the hot goss guys, the hot gossip, we can tell you. 117 in Vegas. Oh my God! You guys, you know, it's so hot in Vegas that you're gonna definitely go see Chris Angel. That's how (laughs) it it makes Chris Angel show good. Yeah, if they have, if he has air conditioning. Uh, favorite game? Favorite video games? Uh, my favorite game, I've been playing a lot of Battlefront, but I know it's not a great game. I just want it to oh, be better. Oh, the Star Wars? Yeah. yeah. I just want it to be better. Uh, I'm a I big wanna, Call of Duty guy, obviously. I want to get into VR stuff. I feel like VR yeah. is going to be the jam. VR is going to be the, it's the future. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Whoa. Uh, oh. I would say I love, what's interesting to me about when I played Star Wars Battlefront, which I yeah. didn't realize. The just, old Battlefront was better, right? Oh, yeah, way better. But it's interesting because I didn't realize how much of those Star Wars sounds are in my oh, game. Yes, that's what you want. Like it's, it's, it's got crazy. all the, It's like a girl that you shouldn't be dating or something, but it's like but at yeah. the same time it's like <laughs> yes. there's enough good stuff there. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. She's like a great dancer or yeah. something. But yeah, it's true because it's like the like just the TIE fighter sound is so oh, I was like so huh. funny. Now they have Bespin Lando's gonna be in Bespin. Woo! It's gonna be great. That's great. Um before that I'm a big Arkham Asylum guy too. I love oh, that. Oh Batman's great. Super fun. Those games are great. I Call of Duty is easy. I mean, not easy, but like that's an easy. Um, everyone likes Call of Duty. Everyone likes Call of Duty. I did Call a commercial of... for Call of Duty. Oh, there we go. I did a commercial. It's on YouTube. Uh, it was like a two-minute commercial, and I had to do my own stunts, and I almost got killed. Oh my God! What happened? Um, I had to go. I had to uh, take a zip line. Holy Jesus! Yeah, that's uh, insane. The that's a real stunt. That's crazy. I had to take a zip line through this giant ball of fire. And, uh, oh my God! And we did it one time. And they're like, "It looks great. Can you do it again?" And so I did it again. And then it, they made this explosion like too big, and it burnt off all the hair on the back of my head. Whoa! It was crazy. Oh my God! That's insane. But uh, but it was a fun commercial. That's pretty fun. I think my favorite video game right now, though, is Now You Can See uh, Me, the video game. Wait, uh, based the, on the movie? Yeah, I mean, it's like a classic. <laughs> you know, you get to play all your favorite characters from the Now You Can See Me franchise. Uh, I like that really... you think it's called Now You Can See Me. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> yeah. How would you say it? Now You Can See Me? Now You See Me. Oh, now you... I was just like, if Daniel Radcliffe is trying to get away from the whole magic thing, why is he in the new How You Can Why You Can See Me? Now you see the movie why where can you see me? I don't think he's, corpse. he's not think, in, he's oh, not in it. It's good. Swiss Army Man. Yeah. Yeah, that's supposed to be good. That's crazy. Oh, by the way, I gotta say, uh, I saw. Well, you were in the short film too. You're a short film. A VR short film. Uh, no, no, no. Oh. A short film. You and what's the woman's name in the? Uh, Michaela. Michaela, where you go to the therapy. Cuddle party. The cuddle party. That's uh, what it was. Yeah. Are you the limo driver in that? No, no I am not. Oh, because no. it looks like your. It eyebrows. looks like. Oh, him. really? It really does. We. Have, I only. I work thought with it was Cher. I was like, this is. Ah, uh, that's hilarious. I only work with people that look like Cher. They got yeah. your eye double. Yeah. I, you know, I, and, I, and that person works a lot in Hollywood. Because uh, it was so whoa. weird. It, it's such a weird. It's like a single of like the limo driver, and he's giving like this yeah. look. And I was like, oh, like that's got to be like a knowing look, like it's Sheer or something. But yeah. it's not. It's not you. No, it just looks like Sheer. Crazy. I hope you're getting royalties then. I'm, at least. I'm getting eyebrow royalties. Eyebrow right. royalties for that. Oh. Um, yeah. How did that come about? How is the how did the short film? Did um, you write it or were you? No, just I didn't write it. I just uh, a guy that uh, a guy that knows Jill Soloway from Transparent. Uh, hey, I won. Uh, uh, this sure. guy that knows Jill Soloway wrote it and uh, asked me and Michaela if we wanted to do it. That's Sometimes great. people just ask you and you have like some time that week and you're like, okay, I'll go do this. That's awesome. Yeah. Yeah, once, once I guess you're in the community and it's big enough, I am just sucking at this. Thoughts on Now You Can See Me 3. Let's green light it. Okay. Guys, so. first of all, it's called Now You See Me. Oh, it's not, not Now You not Can, now you can <laughs> yeah. See Me. Can you now see me? Can you? Will you see Will me? We, are we going to see each other? What am I hiding for? Uh, I think that, um, I think Woody Harrelson's character, uh, 
It was Weirdly, the second, was the second one a flop? It didn't do well. No, right? is it out? It did, didn't even come out yet. Oh, it's not yeah, even it out. Did. It oh, it did. Out. Oh, yeah. uh, it came out and like no one saw it. Oh, but no. it did like just like last weekend, right? It so, came out like uh, two weekends ago and okay. literally like no one saw it. So now oh, it's boy. you can't. You didn't see me. You no didn't. One saw it. No <laughs> one Why saw didn't it. you see me? Yeah, no, yeah, <laughs> nobody <laughs> saw me. That's what it is. Do you like Arby's? People say there's not enough Arby's to really make a strong distinction. Do we have? Do we have one Arby's that I know? Do we have Arby's out here? They we do. There's a great one that has a giant sign. Of a huge cowboy hat. Yeah, that's the uh, that's a classic one. Uh, I like their warm roast beef. I know you guys are going to be gross about this because it's the internet, but I enjoy a nice thick roast beef sand sandwich. Say I do. That, I'm not even say kidding. Say that again, but like super sexy and slowly. <laughs> I Mark enjoy, Ruffalo. Oh, yeah, I, yeah. I can't do sexy. I can do. I can enjoy a nice warm. <laughs> My mom can drive if yours oh, wow, can pick it's up. Oh bike. This is the best. Oh yeah, here we go. This is old. Uh oh, what Meat sweats. Yeah. My friends have this thing called Meat Week, where we eat uh, uh, once a year uh, for an entire week. We eat barbecue every night. Ooh. Really? It's great. Uh, you can go to meatweek.com. Awesome. It's awesome. All over the country. What do you go to? Wait, where is it? Uh, it's everywhere. I how, mean, it's, how is your shitting for that week? It's the worst. Uh, but And then the next week, uh, no joke, is like kale week. Yeah. Got you it, just yeah. eat healthy. You got to balance you yourself You have out. to. Um, this track is not very well maintained because there is mud everywhere. I, I used like to run super bike. slow. Play, so, look me in the eye and say that, Rob Revenge. Someone asked why no more Children's Hospital because Rob Corddry killed it. Killed it. Rob Corddry, um, worst person on the planet. The worst person on the planet <laughs> decided that the best show on TV <laughs> wasn't good enough. Uh, no, I think it just got, you know, we'd done like uh, seven years of it, so I think Corddry yeah. wanted to just do other stuff. Yeah. You know, it's good to get but, out um, before it gets too stale. You know right? what? You know? I agree. We That's did, why beat British television so good. We did three seasons of NTSF, and it was like, yeah. and I'm, I mean, as much as you, you want to leave people like not hating it. Yeah, that's true. We did like seven seasons of the league, and I feel like you know we could have done five. <laughs> there we go. I think people would still watch the league. I I, people, yeah, people really yeah, do yeah. like the league, and I mean, it, but I always feel like it's. Uh, would you ever do like a league movie? I don't think there would be an audience for that. Maybe there would be. <laughs> I don't know. There's I, I an audience know, for the Entourage movie. Yeah, yeah. Jesus. There was an audience for Now You See Me Too. Yeah, all right. Or was there? Do it. Or was right there now. an audience? Yeah, I don't think there was. Yeah, maybe not. See, I'm hitting my gas. I'm not, I feel like I'm not getting any... Yeah, that's how I felt. More human giant, people are saying. Let's do it. There you go. You know, we've worked together a bunch. You know, Aziz, Rob, and I, like, we always are kind of doing stuff. Yeah. Uh, not as human giant, but as people. What does, as, it, as do when, what does yeah. it do when you throw your... Do you guys have things to throw? Like, I'm throwing, like, turtles at people. Yeah. Like, that, Rob plays Aziz's dad. Um, oh. You knock out people on Master of None, and you were great in it. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Oh, a lot of people awesome. think that's Aziz's actual dad, but that was actually me. <laughs> it is weird. The, it's the eye. You guys have similar, we have similar features. facial structure. Yeah. yeah, I think it's bone gun. Did you guys slide on that banana peel like I did? I did, what? yeah. That was the worst. Now I want tacos. Oh, well, somebody would have a sausage fest with us? Okay. I'm not sure where well, that's what coming just from. Happened? Thank we you. just got oil. Thank you. Oh, the in-betweeners made two films. There you go. What do you guys, here's some questions. Like, you guys make a lot of television and movies. What are some things that inspire you? You're like, what, what Black TV Black Mirror shows? is amazing. Oh, Black Love Mirror. Black Mirror. Awesome. BBC show, it's awesome. Yeah. Family uh, Feud. Family Feud. <laughs> Steve Harvey in general, my man. So good. I've been watching The Americans right now. I'm loving oh, The Americans. Oh, great. Uh, Such a I'm good show. I'm watching Mr. Robot. Oh, Mr. Oh, Robot. Mr. Robot's fantastic. amazing. I just watched another one called Happy Valley on Netflix. Did you guys see oh, that? Oh, I haven't oh, no. seen it. It was good. It's crazy because now there's so many shows. I, this yeah, is truly yeah. the golden age of television. I want to really watch a show, is. Banshee. I hear that show is really good. Oh, that's awesome. Banshee that show just ended, good. right? I guess, and now it's a perfect time to catch up. I only watch shows that have ended, so I know I can have a definitive endpoint. There you go. I know. You know what? That is actually that is a great call because yeah. it's that's when shows start getting terrible. It's yeah. like when 24, it's in its 12th season. Yeah. Yeah. Preacher is really good. I think everything I should be like with. three seasons. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. And then yeah, and then maybe like a. Uh, in like a made-for-TV movie. Yeah, or everything should just be miniseries. Yeah. Like just do... Who's in Happy Valley? Uh, no one you know. It's a All British. Right. Uh, it's a British show. Uh, it's a. They're trying to like uh, solve a murder, but it's really good. I feel like if, if you guys could make kind of any Hallmark made-for-TV Lifetime movie, mm -hmm. I feel like you guys have a couple of those in you. Oh my gosh! Did you see that yeah, uh, like James the, Franco yeah, just made? I mean, Mother May I Sleep with Danger, but it's all vampires. It, it, like, Whoa! Yeah, yeah, it just came out. It's and awesome. is it serious or tongue-in-cheek? I mean, it's all vampires, so... <laughs> so serious. <laughs> yeah. 
<laughs> it's real. It's a, Lady it's a Dynamite. documentary. Lady Dynamite is amazing. Oh, yeah. Great call. Lady Dynamite. Lady Dynamite. Is Maria that Maria Bamford? Maria oh, Bamford oh, show. Yeah. I listen to Howard Stern every day. So oh, funny, just, man. Yeah, show. watch Maria Bamford show. It's so hilarious. Good. It's so funny. This is definitely rotten fish. Uh, I, like Kim, I like Kimmy Schmidt's show, too. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's great. What do we think of the latest Star Wars movie? Thumbs up for me. I'm all on board. Oh, of course. Yeah. I loved it. I thought it was great. I didn't see it. I was busy celebrating Christmas. Oh, man. <laughs> You're a bit did you see Jesus. Captain America two, Hubel? Uh, or uh, two or three? Did you see? Yeah, yeah. Did you see the last two? No. Were they good? They're great. They are Civil fun. War they're, was good. They're fun. Civil War is great. Oh really? Civil War, I think, is like one of my favorite Marvel. Because mm. the first Captain America, I didn't like. Are you no, guys comic book guys? Two and no? three. I'm a, I wrote a couple comic books. Oh really? Yeah. What did you write? Uh, I wrote some Deadpool from Marvel. Whoa! Holy crap! Yeah, I, uh, I did my own comic book for Boom. Oh my God! What yeah. was your own comic book about? Uh, called Aliens vs. Parker, and it's kind of like uh, Shaun of the Dead meets Aliens. Whoa! That's um, awesome. And then, uh, then because of that, we got to write some Deadpools. Holy crap! And then, oh, uh, dude, yeah. I definitely want to write a comic book someday. That'd it's be awesome. super fun and hard. Uh, really? Yeah. What makes it you, hard? You're kind of like writing, directing, and acting simultaneously. Oh, and all the beating off takes yeah. so, so much time away. <laughs> Just, like it does. It's hard to do with one hand. Yeah. Well, really yeah. hard. The professionals, like uh, you know Brian Michael Bendis, have beat professional beat offers. Yeah. Well, yeah. For him. I mean, they don't do it to him. They just do it. Yeah. You just yeah. have. Yeah. And they just. I hit the wall. Oh. That was bad. That was bad. Civil War dope. Oh, there you go. Paul Shear's comic book. Link to Paul Shear. Oh, wow. Get that sweet cashish. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There you go. Rob, if you could write a comic, what would it be? Um, like what? What interests you about superpowers? If you could have a superpower besides the whole super pregnancy thing? Yeah, yeah, probably. Um, like preacher, where you could get guys to do what you wanted, or maybe uh, probably just like uh, flying around. Again, shooting va babies out. I mean, I know you said great. we can't do. I it, think but that would be the great. Gift of life. It's the I best. think that would be great to shoot a bunch of babies out. Uh, a bunch of super pregnant, like bikini models. Okay. It was like bikini models that are super pregnant, and they fart out babies. <laughs> oh, they fart out babies. Yeah. That's well, that's where babies come from, right? Oh, yeah. No, their that's moms true. fart them out. Yeah. I Again, so. my wife isn't pregnant, so not I don't sure. know how it works. Yeah. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm still figuring it out. Yeah. It's a lot of. Uh... Yeah, I will say. I think uh, in terms of super, I really like. I think being able to turn into fog would be cool. Ooh, I like the fog. You know, because that'd be cool. Like it'd be so dramatic because you could win any argument. You just you know, fog like, out. No, you oh. shut up and I'd be like, poof. But and you could also uh, become a ninja and then you'll have more powers. What's that again? You become a ninja. Yeah, that's and true. And you could also just have the power of ninja and then fog is a part of that. Yeah. I saw be, it would also be fun to possess animals because I feel like it'd just be really fun to like, I don't know, be a dog and just sniff yeah. people's crotch like all the time. Crotch. Well, I don't know if that's a superpower that people, most people would want. Well, okay. Crotch I might have said too much about guys, my crotch you guys, sniffing. You guys, you guys uh, talking about sniffing crotches? Yeah, yeah, man. You want to get in on this sniff, uh, crotch sniffing thing? That sounds pretty great. Yeah, dude. It's this great club I have. Hashtag crotch sniff. It's, uh, it's a Facebook group I'm this working on. This is so hard to play this game and talk. I know. I think My do favorite part of Piranha 3D, someone asked, <laughs> oh! was... Uh, <laughs> Was essentially uh, was doing a scene that's not even in the movie where my nose got ripped off by a piranha and I was Holy had to crap. swim out in the middle of this Wait, lake. Wait, didn't a piranha bite your dick off? That was Jerry O'Connell. Oh. <laughs> uh, my dick in, was intact, right. as you could see in the sequel. His when face I dick, though. Bing His Rames. face dick got ripped yeah. off. That's what that I called was it. Yeah. How was Ving Rhames? Bing Rames is the best, man. He taught me a lot about butt implants. <laughs> Wait, how real? to spot how to spot a butt implant. For real? Yep. Is that like, butt implant? Butt well, implant. Can you, that it, woman's got a butt implant. Is it secret knowledge or can you pass along how can how Rob and I could spot well, butt implants? I actually think Wait, that I, who, I actually think that he, uh, who, he got are butt implants a real thing? Uh, oh yeah. yeah. Oh, I think dude, he may have yes. gotten dimples and butt implants confused. <laughs> dimples. Like there's like, you know, those dimples above <laughs> the, your ass. Yeah. I think he may have thought like they were all just the back dimps. Yeah, like he may have thought they were all definitely butt implants. Oh, that he thought that people are getting butt implants above the butt. Yeah. Oh no. So, oh, that's awkward. Yeah. So, but I listened to him and I took it all uh, there. It's like one of those things that's and you couldn't correct him at, at that. No, point. I, I. You never want to correct. Ving. That's yeah. You never want to correct Ming Rain. The worst is like yeah. No, never. The worst is like when you're introduced to somebody. And like a couple times, but you never remember their name. Oh, the worst. And, and then it's gone too far past the point where you can ask. Oh, yeah, you can't. That's why I want your phone to have a uh, feature on it that when you get close to someone, it'll tell you everyone's name. Oh, dude. Don't, why does it do that? That's great. That's a great, that's a great app. app. Right? Don't that's tell people. Yeah, don't give that one away. Don't give that well, one away. Well, because it would never so your be. Phone, your phone is scanning for people in your contact. Yeah. Name, yes. So oh, you, it'll brilliant. remind you of their name. That's, that's a great brilliant. idea. Yeah. That's so smart. 
Uh, all right, la guys, this is the last race. This last is race. So this is. Uh, By the way, I think I've won every game of everything, and I haven't <laughs> talked no. at all. Uh, and I'm sorry, but I like to win. <laughs> Wiener, for dead. wiener daps all around. What does that even mean? What's a wiener dap? I think we have to pull our dicks out. Is that like a yeah. wet nap? I want to see a penis implant. A penis implant. They just did a, the first successful penis implant, Shady Fridge. Uh, Whoa. Uh, there's, oh, hope, there's hope for you and your tiny penis. And it's weird that they managed to do like a face, uh, a, like a, a face reconstruction, you know, like where somebody No, no, that's faces. a movie. That's face off. Oh, got it. Yeah. Um, I was thinking that was a documentary of Nicholas Cage. Let's have them all pick who we should be. Here. Okay, that's a good idea. That might take a while. And the last two, right. uh, but just the first ones we see. All right, hit A, hit A. Yes, I saw The Witch, Connor Holt. The Witch was a oh, great movie. Did you see oh, the Oh, was it? I, I thought you said it was terrible. No, The Witch is great. Oh, wait, wait. How is did I David pick? Wayne oh, a jerk in real on. life? No, David Wayne's the best dude. He's David great. Wayne. What do I got to do? Uh, so pick your guy. All right. Can I back out? All right. Face off, but with dicks. Wait, that's a good idea, said Vega. Oh, face off. Dick off? Dicks. Is that what oh, we would call it? I want to. Face off with dicks? Metal Mario. Metal Mario. I'm going to be. How's the sex addiction going? That was from the league. Uh, it's not going well. I'm still addicted to sex. Perfect. But there I are love, worse things. I love Parks and Recreation. I like Parks and Recreation. Someone more said than the I witch th sucked. Fuck you, buddy. The witch was a great movie. <laughs> uh, <laughs> wrong answer. I think I like Parks and Rec more than I like The Office, but that's nothing against The Office. I think it was just two great shows. Yeah, two great shows. Great I was together. on both. Uh, yeah, I like both of them. Talk about assassin movie. Okay. Um, assassin movie. Oh man, when he killed that guy. Oh, I couldn't believe it. Yeah, that was, that was crazy. crazy. When he they got assassinated. They didn't even know. He didn't the, even what know. What was the Keanu Reeves movie? John Wick. John. Wick. Uh, oh, John, John Wick, Wick is amazing. John Wick Two is coming out, I think. Dick really? Chicken is. Uh, yeah, they've shot it. Hit A. I hit A. Okay. Challenge you to Dick Chicken. Is that I'm just where your two them. two dicks are coming together slowly and then, uh, <laughs> and then are they gonna touch? Or are they gonna veer? Uh, dick chicken is something from the league. Oh, okay. Where what you take chicken? out your dicks and you get as close as you can. Whoever flinches first, perfect, um, is the loser of dick chicken. Now, right. wh why is that terrible? Or what would happen if two people touch dicks? Like, why? Just keep it going. Just, I think. Well, I, the worst would be like, I mean, if you were if you were a homophobic and you didn't want this, that's true. It would be button dick chicken because that would really be yeah. Like that would be the yeah. you know. I don't think there's any. Dick Chicken just sounds like a sat a normal Saturday for What's me. What's the most anticipated movie that we all have in our minds? I think I'm excited about Rogue One. I'm mm. excited about Rogue, Rogue One. Suicide Looks Squad. Great. Suicide Squad. I think that's gonna suck. Oh really? I think that all those ah, Warner Brothers I movies right. don't are never pay off. We're on good. the Warner Brothers lot, bro. Yeah. Uh oh, <laughs> oh <laughs> Cage comes down. Yeah. Dead. Um, no, but I um, look. They have to win me back because <laughs> that, those fucking the SB's, Superman movie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, they're terrible. Like I, think I, I just want ate it to be like, good. A, like a fried chicken you jelly bean. Smell it around. What is fried? It? I don't know what that is. What is. There's like not a fried, fried chicken. chicken one. Maybe it's just a bad one. <laughs> Rob's gonna. <laughs> Rob's gonna. It's not even a real one. It really is fried chicken. <laughs> all right, this is the last race. This all is right, for all the marbles. All right, here we go. go. Baby Park. Peach Dragon. There we go. First movie I saw in the theater was, I think it was Star Wars. Ooh, the wow. The first movie you ever saw? The first movie I ever saw in the theater. Wow, I don't know. First concert I ever went to, uh, Color Me Bad, opening up for Paul Abdul. Whoa, wow. Really? I, I was there for Color Me Bad. Wow. It was amazing. Um, oh, yeah. First concert? Uh, first concert for me was Billy Joel. Woo! We started. Nothing. First concert yeah. for me was the Bee Gees with my mom. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Who, well, who liked the Bee Gees more, you or your mom? My mom. Oh, and perfect. we made out. <laughs> perfect. Got yeah. lucky. Yeah. That's the best night. Oscar what are some season. other, while we're paying attention to the screen, what are some other questions that we can... Like, uh, I'll prove it anyone I want to touch dicks. It's a chat. How are you going to touch dicks? Yes, Transformers counts in the movie. Uh, BB-8 turned out to be a cute robot as advertised. I just I just heard that uh, Bill Hader and uh, Ben Schwartz were the voice of BB-8. Well, I think that they were that brought true? in to play around with the voice. But, I mean, that I wasn't see. like, they're, they're not... BB they're not doesn't like, have a voice. It's like beep bop yeah. boop boop boop. You know? Whoa, holy! That's, beep, a, bop, that's bop, a great bop, impression. Bop, bop, bop. Hey, uh, I have a here spoiler alert for you, Star Wars fans. Here we go. BB-8 is Ray's father. Ah, gotcha. It's just opened up and it's Obi Wan's head yeah. inside. <laughs> Dark would that be? Yeah, that would be amazing. I'd <laughs> be like, oh my god, <laughs> takes a terrible turn. Um, I gotta say, yeah, JJ uh, knows what he's doing. Well, well I'm looking forward to Star Trek. Actually, I'm a big Star Trek fan, and I like. Uh, I'm looking forward to Justin is Simon, Lin. Is Simon Pegg now in both, uh, yeah. both worlds? But yep. Simon Pegg is like a, an alien. He's not. He wasn't a real <laughs> yeah, person. Yeah. Like, he's he's, I don't think voice. his character's coming back either. Okay. Exactly. He's Wait, just, Rob, you did a voice for Despicable Me, right? I did. How was that? It was super fun. I, I, I was wish that I your could... first voice? 
voice or um, No, I've done a lot of TV voices, but I think movie voice, that might have been my first one. But uh, the voiceover stuff is the best because you literally show up, you know, in a t-shirt and jeans That's and awesome. hungover and you do a voice and you get paid a lot of money, you know. <laughs> so, awesome. yeah, I did a voice for a cool uh, show that no one thought was going to be cool because the movie was so uh, in the middle. Uh, Tron. I did a Tron oh, cartoon. Oh, damn. But it looked like Animatrix and it was really cool. Oh, look at that. Nice. This gorilla can't be stopped. Woo, look at that biceps. Lock look at Tron, those biceps. Awesome. Yeah, I did, uh, I did Axe Cop with Nick Offerman uh, and oh, Pat cool. and yeah, Oswald. That's awesome. And uh, that was a fun one. Unbelievable. Did you finish? Ah, oh, 12? Is that you? Um, yeah, look, guys. I but did... you know what? A lot of you're carrying the you're carrying the weight on the talk. You're carrying I, well, all the weight. Yeah. I didn't talk at this all. guy is just he doesn't. He well, just, now I want to talk. I gotta finish. Just, oh, now yeah. I want to talk, guys. Boom. Me and Paul Love really want to plug Donald Trump 2016. He's a great 16. guy. Get in there, vote, vote often. He's a vote really early. great guy. Matt, vote early, vote often. <laughs> He's really gonna help the country out. We're all gonna <laughs> build walls around our houses. Yeah. It's gonna be great. And so, uh, vote for Trump. Also, uh, Paul Shear, Rob Hubel, let's give it up for him. Thank Follow you, Follow him at Paul Shear so and at Rob Hubel on Twitter and Instagram, both. Uh, for this guy, Transparent comes back in the fall on Amazon. Uh, Keanu's out now. This guy, uh, Filthy Preppy Teens, you can see off fullscreen.com. Yes. And, uh, what else well, we got? Pop, Star. Pop Star's out now. Pop, Pop Star's Star out now, which is like hilarious. It's unbelievable. It's a fun movie. It's really I, super funny. I, it's, I hear it's hilarious. So uh, follow those guys. Thank you for joining us. This has been bye, 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 Stream bye, 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 Coco. Bye, 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 we'll see you guys bye, 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 next bye, bye, Monday. Bye! bye, 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 bye. bye.